Hi, I'm Sam Coons with Bighorn Armory. This is one of our Model 90As. This one is actually for sale right now, sitting in our safe. This is our gray laminate wood. It's much denser than standard wood, which means if you get it wet, it'll rot slower. If it gets scratched, it doesn't show up as bad. It helps with recoil because of the density and weight. And overall, it just looks cool. This rifle has our fiber optic front sight on it, a scout scope mount also. Once again, this is an 18 inch 454 Casual rifle. We will be shooting a few water jugs with it to start with. We will be using 335 grain bullets, which are these, these hard casts. Once again, this rifle is in stock. If you would like it, please give us a call and we can help you out. Good to go, hot to trot, ready yep. to party? Go ahead. Awesome. Well, let's go set them up again. That wasn't as climactic as I was hoping. <laughs> okay, let me go set those back up. Ready? Yep. Last round. Huh? See, I've told a lot of people this. In my opinion, the 454 is better than the 460. You've got just as much power, more rounds in the magazine tube for capacity, less recoil. I personally think this rifle is awesome. It's hard to beat. Let's go see what it did. So, we had all, to start with, we had all of our jugs sitting up here on top of the board. The first one I shot was a peanut container and it's all the way over there on the other side of the berm. The other one I shot knocked all the rest down, it fell down there and it's sitting over there. Those ones, I hit all of them on the right side. So you got one there, one there, one all over there, one there and one behind our board over there. Now, just taking a look, remember these are hard cast bullets. It came in here, exited there, but tore this entire container all up in there. So those did a real number on our targets. Then you got one like this, which I'm guessing I hit about dead center. So don't let somebody lie to you. The 454 Casul is one bad rifle. <laughs> 